So what, what perhaps were you texting about? That's none of your business. I... <laughs> <laughs> was that before or after the slap? I don't know what you're talking about. No comment on the slap gate. Andrew Garfield found himself in the hot seat on The View. The 38-year-old actor stopped by the daytime show on Thursday with his Under the Banner of Heaven co-star Daisy Edgar Jones and admitted he has regrets about the viral photo of himself texting at the Oscars. I feel so bad because... You know, Kevin Costner's <laughs> introducing the director nominees in the most beautiful and elegant way, and I'm like, there's no way I'm going to be on camera during this. At first, the Amazing Spider-Man star played coy, but eventually he did clarify that he was on his phone because multiple messages were coming through about the altercation between Will Smith and Chris Rock. And everyone's texting me, asking me, you know, what, the, what they're asking me, like, you what know. the vibe in the room is. <laughs> and I'm, you know... I'm At awesome. that moment, my friends took priority over Kevin, but I, but, but I feel, I feel <laughs> so really bad about that. As for Andrew's take on the infamous slap, he didn't want to add his opinion to the convo. Oh, no, gosh. No, I can't. I can't. I mean, it's, like, it's commercial, isn't it? But, but also, everything's been said. <laughs> But everything's also, like, been everything's said. been said, you know, like, there's no need for me to weigh in on that. It's every possible version of the discussion has happened, and I yeah. have no interest in adding my voice to something that's well, already been so good. well you'll stay safe, because they go about. after you the minute you open your mouth. The Hacksaw Ridge star had a busy year of acting, which meant a busy award season. He reprised his role as Spider-Man in Spider-Man No Way Home, co-starred alongside Jessica Chastain in The Eyes of Tammy Faye, for which she won the Best Actress Oscar, and he was nominated himself for Best Actor in Tick, Tick, Boom. Access Hollywood recently spoke with Andrew about the highs and lows of attending award shows, and he revealed the tea about his Oscars red carpet kiss with fellow actor and longtime friend Jamie Dornan. I was talking to someone about it, and it's like, I've been at the events where no one wants to talk to me. I've been at the events where some people want to talk to me. I've been at the events where a lot of people want to talk to me. And then I've been at the events where no one wants to talk to me again. I enjoy it when it's great, and I try to enjoy it when it's not good, too, and, and not take it personally. Someone who's experienced the highs and lows of fame with Andrew is his longtime friend, Jamie Dornan, whom he just shared a kiss with on the Oscar red carpet. We asked Andrew to break down the moment. <laughs> I was like, who is this going to be? Jamie? I'm so jealous. To share that with someone that you've struggled with, that you've kind of been unemployed with, and you've been waiting tables with, or you've been sharing meals with because you can't afford more than one, and then to be able to share going to the Oscars together, you know, it's, it's, it makes it more meaningful. You have to give them a kiss. It's like, you know, it's a beautiful thing.